Great Britain are getting close now to taking a lap on the rest of the field. Great Britain now are about to be the first team to take a lap here in this Madison. This is getting close. And the pace on the front of the peloton is going to get higher any moment now. But Owen Dahl comes racing round. And that puts Great Britain one lap ahead of the rest of the race. The Italian team are closing in. They are bringing the Spaniards across. They're bringing the French across. Owen Dahl has absolutely nothing in those legs at all. This is how tough this race is. He's absolutely on his knees right now. Italy coming across, this will change the whole race. And any moment now, France are going to go top of the leaderboards. And France are going to be now the leaders of this Madison. And that has completely changed the shape of the race. They sense the victory. If Italy can get the five points, then they would be their champions. But there needs to be a gap of three, point, of three points between them. Look at this. This is a furious sprint for the line. Two laps to go. It's all going to come down to this. Italy looking to try and beat the French. And still Australia slightly ahead. We're coming round with one lap to go. Australia with Glenn O'Shea could get the five points. Brian Cockard is looking to try and give a world title to France. Is he going to do it? This is going to be tight. Elia Viviani sprinting against him. Viviani is going for the line. This is going to be it. Italy take it. Italy take the points. Oh, and France, though, will be the world champions. They'll end up on 21. Uh, congratulations, guys. Morgan, how did you do that? What, that was an incredible race against the Italians. Yeah, yes, it, it was a... Uh... A very hard race with uh, the Italian guys and the English guys take a, take a lap. And uh, it, it was uh, not easy for me and Brian. We were strong for this race and the last, uh, the last uh, in the final of the race, uh, we have maybe, uh, I think we have the best and uh, we, we take a, a lap for, for the win. The world champions France, silver medalists Italy and Belgium take the bronze.